Minions. Yes, sir. Please give us a raise. Prime Day is coming up. Woo! Fake deal. Yeah. Fake My children deal. Have food. We set the scam prices and scam so all allow of our businesses customers. to raise their price one month before Prime Day, then lower it back to make it look like a deal. Yeah, Duh. yeah. Awesome. Our staff is overweight, but we're still underpaying them. The working class sucks. You did good. Thanks. Fear of missing out is making them buy more items they don't need. We did Flawless it, sir. Victory. But sir, if we're already a trillion dollar company, why are we scamming our customers? So we can get more <laughs> money. <laughs> <Duh>. <laughs> <laughs> but sir, isn't it bad for our image if customers figure out we're just lying to them? Look, do you think they're smart enough to figure out no. that we're letting these companies raise the price of their item one month before Prime Day <laughs> and then dropping it back to the original price to scam everybody to think they're getting a so deal? So we're giving poor people false hope to save money so we can get richer? Absolutely! <laughs> <laughs> But sir, this is why people don't trust big businesses. What if they figure out your Who scam? Who cares? Look, profits are quadrupling, meaning business is booming and business is good. I need more billions on top of my billions. Just how many billions do you need? Our customers don't deserve that. Think we care about that. We paid Megan the Stallion to endorse Prime Day. Why? What does she know about supply and warehouse? <laughs> sir, what if a competitor comes up and actually cares about them? Aren't you afraid of them switching hey, over? As long as they keep buying, we're going to keep doing the same thing. If it works, why would we fix it? They're never gonna be smart enough to figure it out. And when they do, <laughs> I'll just stop. <laughs> <laughs> Good show.